Singing superstar Whitney Houston has received worldwide recognition. She sold millions of albums and won countless awards. But today in East Orange, New Jersey, she received what could be considered the best recognition yet. Lee Thomas has more. Today was a big day for this school in East Orange, New Jersey. She was an excellent student, very nice, very uh, charismatic. She was an enjoyable youngster, well-behaved and intelligent. Because one of its former students is lending this elementary school her name. That's right. From this day forth, the Franklin School will be known as the Whitney E. Houston Academy of Creative and Performing Arts. It brings a lot of joy to your heart to see young people wanting to do creative dance and, 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 and music. It, it, was, it was a thrill for me to watch young people dance and sing to my music. It was great. And with her husband, Bobby Brown, her mother, father, and even Arista Records chief, Clive Davis, in attendance, the celebration began. There was dancing and singing of all kinds as the school marked its new beginning with one of its most famous graduates. And she left them with a word of advice. You can fly, you can do anything, just work hard. Work really hard and stay with it. And when they say no, you say yes. I did. It was the Franklin School, but now it's the Whitney E. Houston Academy of Creative and Performing Arts. Whitney E. Houston? What does the E stand for? Ebony. I don't know. Elizabeth. Um... Elias. Elizabeth. <laughs> and you're named after your grandmother? Yes, am I, right? I am. Whitney Elizabeth Houston. <laughs> and according to Elizabeth's husband, this day could be the start of a new trend. There's a lot more that she's going to be doing, so there'll be a lot more schools named after her, I hope. <laughs> From East Orange, New Jersey, Lee Thomas, Channel 7, Eyewitness News. Wow. Congratulations. Looking good. Yeah. And